What's up guys? I know it's been a while. Uh, probably what? A year and a half, two years since we've done an episode. Mm -hmm. But we're back with something pretty cool and I think this is actually pretty awesome for a first episode back. I have completely handmade shoes that I made myself for my son. And these are, it's in the 1985 Jordan 1 Silhouette. And I started from scraps, just like strips of leather and cut everything out and then sewed it and assemble it myself by hand. Even gave him some custom tags. Got a football, his initials, and an Xbox controller on there since football and Xbox are his favorite things to do. Uh, what else? Got it made from real shark skin. It's up here. And then we have like this leather that has been pressed to look like alligator and it's got this like iridescent finish to it. I don't know, what's your favorite part about these? Um, the logo. The Jordan logo or your custom one? That one, the custom. The ones on the tongue? Yes. So on the tongues you got, like I showed you that one already and then I put my logo on the other one. And then he got on the inside he's got this really nice man oh, he just keeps talking i wonder what's for dinner some really nice like ashen green lamb skin liner so it's nice and soft and yeah just comfortable took a authentic jordan sole ripped it off a of jordan one and put it on this so we had the legit full jordan one And then, yeah, he went with the mismatch swishes on these because originally he did want this like turquoise color, but when he saw these, whoops, that alligator stuff come in, he changed his mind quickly. So one shoe came out with the swoosh and the front wing having that alligator, whereas this one, just the wing is the alligator and that swoosh is the turquoise. Yes. Other than that, other than that, other than that, they match up though, huh? Yeah. Got a nice toe box on them. Fits pretty well to like store bought, store made. Comfortable. Or manufacturer made Jordans. Very yeah. Comfortable. Super comfy. I'm just jealous you got the shark skin ones too, and the nice shape. Because compared to them in here. Please. Oh. Compared to these, compared to my Jordan ones, these are the first Jordan ones I made. They're a lot nicer. His shoes are pretty much, they are just as tall as mine. <laughs> I mean, mine's nice, but messed toes up. messed up. This toe's a lot rounder. And the height's messed up because I pulled the liner too tight on some of it. The heel's kind of messed up. Used the wrong. Um, heel counter in it, it was just the wrong shape, so it kinda, you'll notice it's caved in kinda on one side. But, I mean, just all progress, it's just all parts of learning. You'll get better as you do more. Yep, I'm already. This one's a lot better. These are, I mean, these are the ones I started with, which, they're not bad, but Ooh, they're even a little better. rougher than the ones. Also, those took you a lot longer to make. What? Oh, the purple ones? Yeah. Alright, so the camera stopped for a second. I don't know what happened. But, um, anyway, I would just use this as a chance to go to the video that I have. It's basically just the whole process of me building the shoe. Well, most of it. And a little video of the shoe, too. Hope you guys enjoy. Bye. Oh my god, that's totally like a big fan exclusive. When I walk out, I got big boots matched with big socks, big tools. I gotta be on deck with big glocks, baby. Bougie, and then she get big top. I'm smooth, chillin' hoe. You can kick rocks, but you got big boots matched with big socks, big tools. I gotta be on deck with big glocks, baby. Bougie, and then she get big top. I'm smooth, chillin' hoe. You can kick rocks. Got the club bangin' all the way to the tip top. Got the club out jumpin' them niggas crisscross. Niggas, knackers on my neck to see that lip gloss. Real niggas back and style, shout out the big pop. Skinny nigga, but I'm dripping. Oh shit, 
did I say I'm dripping, but to say different too. Chains pimping when I get the mic, spitting doggy dog like Snoop. When I get the mic, gripping thirsty. Niggas get the dripping when they get to sipping. I just sit back, observe, watch, and I just listen. I don't fuck with thirsty hoes, so I simply dismiss them. And the independent women, yeah, you know I'm fucking with them. Big hair, baby girl, you hot, but I don't be chasing thoughts. Fuck you, thought. I don't really give a fuck about what you bought. All that bragging and that boasting gon' get you caught. Big boots match with big socks. Tools I gotta be on deck with big blocks, baby. Boo cheating and she get big top. I'm smooth, chillin' hoe. You can kick rocks, what you got? Turn it up, just got me vibing in the booth, cuz I'm making bangers batting like Babe Ruth, huh? Niggas creepin', gotta watch how you move, but ain't never trippin', nigga. I'm big smooth. Who is you? Niggas need the goose to get real loose. Fuck that. I just get up in the booth and spit the truth. You can watch how I do what I do when I do, but you can never bring that heat like big smooth. Got me banging shit like back in 92. Six phone pilot hitting switches like Dre do. Ho, niggas acting fake. I watch how they move. Run up on them, take their wallet, and I'm taking they boots. Small boots match with small socks. They don't fit me, so I dropped them out the block. Cause a little homie gonna need some new socks and them boots. And them boots clean, I know he gonna rock. Big boots match with big socks. Big tools, I gotta be on deck with big locks, baby. Bougie, and then she get big top. I'm smooth, chillin' ho. You can kick rocks, what you got? Big boots match with big socks. Big tools, I gotta be on deck with big locks, baby. Bougie, and then she get big top. I'm smooth, chillin' ho. You can kick rocks.
So I hope you guys enjoyed that video of Bryson's shoes being made. Um, I feel like this was a pretty cool episode to come back on, a pretty cool project to present. Um, we're definitely going to be having a lot more interesting stuff coming. I'm trying to expand what I'm working on, expand my skills, try different stuff. Um, that being said, I'm going to try to do more videos the style of the one you just saw, where I kind of show more of the process and not just the finished product. Um, but yeah, thanks guys. If you have any suggestions for anything, uh, throw it down in the comments. We'll try to check out what you guys have in mind and cover anything that you guys want to see. Bye.